Hey everybody, welcome back to Rocky Mountain Hunts. This is our Azure Standard Haul for the month of June. I just got home a little bit ago, so I'm going to take you guys along and show you my haul. So in all the years that I have bought from Azure Standard, which is, oh, I think since 2017, I have never purchased one of these surprise produce boxes. And I thought I'd give it a try, <laughs> which I think it has its pros and its cons. It has its pros because you can get creative if there are certain things that you never purchase like this, I don't purchase. And these I never, ever purchase. So I'm really going to have to get creative with those. But um, it's, it's a different variety. So you have no clue what you're getting. I just figured I'd give it a go. So it looks here like we have some blueberries, which are always fun. Um, although the problem and the problem with this is yes, it's a variety. And I think it's really cool because it can, um, have you use different ingredients you normally wouldn't use in cooking, but for, you know, having eight kids, like I would buy a couple of these. So it's really small portions. Um, that's the only downsize of getting one of these. If you're a large family, it's fun cause it's a variety, but if you cook large scale, um, or snack large scale, it's, it's, um, going to get a little tricky. So anyway, we got some blueberries. We got a little carton of some pears. We have some mandarin oranges. We have some nectarines. Um, I think there's an onion, two zucchini. So once again, like I said, you know, large family, I don't know what exactly I'm going to do with that. I might be able to make some zucchini muffins. We also have two things of avocados in here and I have two oranges. There's also some potatoes and just a variety of things in here. So as you can see, um, there's also over here, a red onion, two garlic bulbs, and yeah, that's it. So just some potatoes, onions, garlic, nectarines, zucchini, pears, and, oh, and two oranges and some mandarins and pears. And that is their variety package. So we use the foaming hand soap pumps and I like to keep Castile soap to refill those with water. And then I have toilet bowl clean, some grapefruits. Over here, I bought some radishes to throw into a salad. We have my husband's aunt and uncle coming up from California to visit tomorrow. So I bought a three pound bag of their salad because I didn't think I'd have time to go to the grocery store. And I got two things of celery. I also got some more rhubarb and I got some yellow organic onions. I need to dehydrate the last bags of onions I got. I just did not have the time. I know there's a few videos. I'm like, I'm gonna do this video. And um, it just didn't happen because I honestly ran out of time and couldn't really use things the way I wanted to use them. Over here, I have Stacy's Organic Tortillas. I love these. We've been out of these for a couple months. So I like having these on hand. And I buy the three pack. So I have the three pack of, oh, these are probably 10 inch. I don't know where it says, but probably 10 inch. And these are, I think, eight inch. Um, and then a three pack of the smaller ones as well really convenient to have in the freezer. This is a frozen item on Azure standard website. So good to have on hand over here. I also have their everything bagels, some of these to throw in the freezer. And then over here, I know I skipped over this. I, this is something new. I saw my friend had it in her cart. Um, part of being the drop coordinator. Um, you can, you can see everybody's cart. So now I feel like I've like pried into her privacy. But anyway, so these are collagen peptides. And um, I just looked up a little bit about what they do. And I figured it's something I want to give a go um, and try adding it into some things, um, coffee, smoothies. Over here, we have the Nancy's cream cheese because I am out. And I have Nancy's sour cream because we are out. Brick of mozzarella cheese and the calico cheese. It's like a Monterey and Colby, I think. Over here, I bought peaches. They are back in season and I am so thankful my dogs don't want to leave my side. Copper and Ellie are actually with me right now and they're just passed out. It's hot. It's actually finally hot out. It's like 70 something degrees where the past, I don't know, week or two, actually the past couple months has been raining every day and has been bitter cold um so this is our first warm day is yesterday and today anyway i got peaches there back in season i'm so so happy i need to make some pe peach jam and preserves and i actually make a homemade barbecue sauce with peach preserves so it works great anyway got peaches i'm so excited they are back 
I got the July flyer. Guys, can you, I don't even look at these. I just go online, but can you even believe it's already almost July and then it's like August and school stuff again? It's crazy. I, I don't even know where the time has gone. It's just mind boggling. Over here, I bought... Oops, let me take that off. Over here, I bought 10 pounds of jalapenos again. Um, these were spilled out in the truck. He saw them spilled out and said to take a picture because some of them, actually more toward the bottom, have a lot of soft spots. And I wanted to preserve these. But, you know, when you preserve, when you can or dehydrate, you really want best quality. Um, and some of them are really smushy. Um, so we will see uh, what I can actually, yeah, see what I mean, what I can actually do with these. But these just may be some, oh my gosh, dogs. This might just turn into jalapeno poppers for the freezer at this point. Over here, they had Greek yogurt, Nancy's brand. I had no clue um, that they sold Greek yogurt. So it's a little bit more pricey than what I buy. I usually buy the Greek gods at Sam's Club, the honey vanilla but I'm like, you know what? <laughs> I already did Sam's Club. I did a whole Sam's Club haul, you guys. It was $1,500 or more. I don't even remember. But I didn't do a video on it because we were coming back from a Rockies baseball game. And long story short, we picked it up like two minutes before Sam's Club closed. They weren't happy with us. And we got home and we all as a family threw it in the fridges and freezers and put it away quickly because it was so late. So did not film that. But Anyway, I totally forgot to add ricotta on that Sam's Club. So I have two ricotta cheese. Um, yeah, I have two ricotta cheese and then my dogs are in the way. Okay, guys, so I'm just going So anyway, that is it for this Azure Standard Hall. I'm going to get these plants planted. I need to wrap this up. I have company coming tomorrow from out of state and we have so much construction going on. And I know you can't even see, but like that whole flat area is just about done. We just got recycled asphalt because this was a ridiculously muddy mess. The flat area has been excavated um, by my husband. Well, his one of his guys is over here now. So we have gravel down and he is just spreading asphalt right now before he goes home for the day. My husband is at a baseball practice with my son. So I could stay home and do what I need to do. But um, anyway, yeah, so lots of <laughs> lots of progress being made, tons of asphalt deliveries, tons of pea gravel deliveries. And we have some plans that are changing for down here in this flat area. So anyway, I don't want to make this a much lengthier video than I can see it's already turning into. So I will do an update video um, showing all the areas in our property that we have been working on anyway. I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Take care. I will see you on the next video and God bless. Okay, you guys, we were putting away the Azure Standard Hall and I'm like, wait just a minute. I'm forgetting things. And yes, we did. We left them in the garage. So I also wanted to show that they do have canned fruit. I'm going to sneeze. Hold on. Excuse me. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> we have a little bit of a cold right now. Um, Anyway, they do have canned fruits and vegetables right now. So I did get these, um, a 12 pack case of some pear have. Um, and then I got some canned artichoke hearts and I also got some canned pineapple chunks. And then down here, two cases, I think they're two six packs of mandarin oranges. So just wanted to say that that is something new that they are. You got what? The fan is cool. I know because it's hot. So canned fruits and vegetables. This is something that is newer that I have not seen before. And a lot of next to these said new on them. So I am pretty sure this just happened that they just started carrying things like this. So I definitely look forward to getting canned fruits and vegetables from them um, in the future. So, I mean, as long as it makes sense cost-wise, because it definitely is a little bit more expensive um, than what you would get like at Sam's Club in bulk. But once again, it was convenience because I forgot to add these to my Sam's cart. And they don't even have artichoke carts at Sam's anyway, or pineapples. So anyway, you do your research, you see what works best for your family. But if you guys did not know, this is something new that they are now starting to carry. So I have some plants to plant and some chipmunks to chase off my deck with my dogs. So I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Take care.